With a 26-4 record, the Red Lake boys basketball team is headed back to state for the third straight year. The Warriors haven't lost a game since January 22nd and are heading into the Class A tournament on a 14-game win streak. But it was a loss that happened before the season even started that set the tone for this year. Just three weeks before the Red Lake basketball season was set to begin, tragedy struck the team and head coach Roger White. It's been a tough season. I lost my son and he's... So this season's kind of dedicated to him. For White, losing 15-year-old son Aaron to cancer made it hard to focus on basketball. That's one thing that, that has really helped me is these, these young men behind me. I tell them almost every day that, you know, if it wasn't for you, you young men that I wouldn't be coming back here because it, it's been really hard for me, you know, emotionally. And, and they really lighten up my day and, and help me get through the day. But the team has rallied around him and now they're headed back to state. Well, this season's kind of dedicated to him, so it's, it's been up and down, but right now it's, it's it's really exciting. And I'm excited to go back with my team. We worked really hard throughout the season and it's going to be a fun experience. After exiting in the first round the last two years, the Warriors will have to rely on their defense to make a run in this year's tournament. We just have to go down there, play our game, let everything happen. We're not going to change the game plan. We're going to push the ball, play defense, get out in transitions. We've got to play defense, we got to rebound, we got to get out in transition, uh, limit our turnovers. But they believe anything is possible. I feel like this is the team to make a, to be able to do something down there. It's going to be a fun experience. It's going to be lots of laughs. It's going to be a lot of uh, hard plays. I'm very excited. Uh, I feel this is the year we're going to do something. Especially with their guardian angel, Aaron, watching over. I want to say he's, he's there. You know, helping us make the buckets and helping us play defense and cheering us on. And if you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.